Hello and welcome back to my playthrough of Ultima 4 Quest of the Avatar. We are right where we left off, level 4 of Dungeon Shame. And the red dot is where we're at, so we're right at the crook of that. We came up the ladder that we see off to the west. I didn't really want to explore this whole thing, and we may not explore the one door going to the south there. But I do want the blue orbs that are in that room. So we're probably going to go in there. I don't know if all these are going to be combat rooms or not, but we'll find out. But what appears fairly clear is that there is not a uh, stone unless it's in a combat room. I still don't know if that's possible. Uh, so my plan is, is as quickly as we possibly can, let's get up to level three. Um, and the, uh, I want to use the, the ladder that's in the up, upper uh, left-hand quadrant there that's got an up and down arrow. So uh, I'm hoping maybe this might be something that we can use to take up multiple levels. That would be kind of nice. And then we can peer at the stone in each one of them and see if we can see where the stone is. Because that's the ultimate goal. We're not really all about, you know, necessarily exploring all of these uh, to the nth degree, we want to find the stones. And that's the whole point. So, whoops. Yeah, see, it's been at least once an episode. We got to do that. Okay, so we are going to go into this first door. And it's our murder room. Oh, that's interesting. We got a bunch of rats. And we've got... Um, Sea serpents. Fascinating. I really didn't want to bring her down. I You should have attacked. I'm off to an excellent start here today already. Um, okay, so... That one's gone already. I think I want my melee people to cross the bridge and deal as much as they can with these rats. I mean, we'll help them out. I like that there's pretty much one hit so far. That's kind of kind of nice. Come over here. You can get on the bridge. You can come over. I don't know if uh, Katrina there is ever going to have a chance to lay any steel on anybody. But, you know, never hurts to, to try. So, yeah. Oh, you went back there. All right. Of course, now we're missing. Okay, that one's got a little bit of HP to him. All right, attack. And we miss. Attack. Okay, another one down. I'm curious if the, if, I don't know if that's a sick person or a, or injured person or a dead person that's uh, on the island there. I'm curious if we'll be able to talk to them. Or maybe search their body. I've never tried to do that on a dead person. If you can search their body. I don't even know if that's a thing in this game. Interesting. Interesting idea. I may have to try that. Uh, okay. Joffrey, oh, you can't do anything, but you can look, you can brandish your sword and look terrifying behind, behind him. Okay, that works. All right. We're down to three rats and that's it. And that one's fleeing. You're on a little island. I don't expect that to work out very well for you. And now you're dead. All right. Uh, I'm just, I'm not going to bother moving my people. I'm just going to leave the rest of these guys where they're at. And if they can help take out this rat, then I guess they can. I probably should have moved Joffrey at least. And maybe I'll move... I, I forget, is that, is that... Oh, it's Jana. Okay, yep. That's what I was going to say. So I, I like my... I like that my uh, instincts were correct. All right. We are done. Uh, I'm going to see... If uh, Joffrey there, if he can talk to the person on the island, um, or if we can search his remains, and everybody else, we have to skedaddle down across this, 
the southern edge of this water. Everybody else I'm going to work on getting out of here, although I don't think we will actually have anybody leave. I, he went the wrong way. Joffrey, you don't get to leave yet. Sorry. Um, and I'm not going to move. I'm going to stay right where I am. All right, let's get these people moving. That's me. Joffrey, this is a very delicate mission that we've entrusted to you. Don't screw it up. <laughs> Uh, no, no pressure. No pressure at all. What could possibly go wrong? He's dead or sick or ailing. All right. Over, 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 down. We can't talk. Okay. Probably because we're in combat. Okay, I can't go... We can't stand over him. We can't stand in his spot. So can we search? Not here. We can't search either? Well, that's weird. Okay, I guess we really can't do anything with this guy. So I guess we might as well just get, get gone and get through. Get about our business. And I don't see any reason at this point to not start getting people out of here. I won't let anybody actually cross until we get Joffrey across the bridge, just in case. Okay, I think we're I think we're safe to have people leave. We've only got two ways to go, so and this is the way we want to go. So, that makes life easier. All right, I'll get these last two out of here and Oh, we got another one. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, so I I did I guess I didn't think the center one was going to be a um another potential combat room. We want to leave here. Well, let's see. I guess we need to go kind of straight across if we want to go to the orbs. And so let's go to the orbs first, but we apparently have to we I don't think we can do anything about a whirlpool, although it would probably do us damage. That was maybe not the best move. But we do have a ghosty to kill. And we've got a squiddy. Well, we've got a squiddy to kill. Uh, I should have had those people actually start moving. Whoops. And that was Joffrey. That's Katrina. Yeah, that was a mistake. That's my bad. I don't know what's going to happen to us if we get touched by the whirlpool. I'm guessing some damage. Nothing, or not, I guess it's not a whirlpool; it's a water spout, and I'm not at all certain we're going to be able to keep all of our party away from this darn thing. It seems to be heading in kind of a southerly direction. I guess we'll see if it's going to stick that way. Can we? Oh, we can. We can attack the. The tw it's a twister, and we can attack it. What the what? <laughs> <laughs> the dungeon is such a weird place. All right, let's uh, let's get some uh, hurt hurting on the twister. It's only barely wounded. And if we can hurt it, then... All right, the squiddy's already out of the way. 
Come on. Heavily wounded. Yeah, I really wouldn't think a bow, an arrow is going to do too much for it, but, um, you know. We seem to be doing some damage. It's fleeing now. Experience 16, Twister killed. Okay. Boy, I, you just see all sorts of weird stuff in dungeons, don't you? Never, I mean, we've seen those things when we're sailing. I've never conceived, so I want to go to the uh, east. Yeah, I want to go to the east to get to the orb room. So we got to continue up this way. All right, get these people out of here. And we're going to have to come back through here. to go to the north once we're done in the orb room I'll call it for lack of a better descriptor to um, get over to where that ladder is Okay, so here we are, the last room that's going to take us to the orb room, and we've got a few things to kill. We've got two Cyclops and a sea creature and a Squiddy, so let's get to killing. All right, I need to, I think I need my two melee folks. Maybe we'll have them peel off and see if they can take out the Cyclops. Well, I should have had them move over because it's not like they're going to get a line. Oh, all of the, all of the hate, all of the hate. I don't, I don't understand this hate. All right, Squiddy's gone. So I had to move over. All right, so let's get down here. I'm going to go down and help too. And everybody else, I'm going to move towards getting out of here. Okay, it wasn't a lot of gold there. We got all of 21 pieces. Okay, so what the, what the, what the uh, map showed us is we got an orb and a fountain behind it. And if I turn to the north, we have an orb and then a fountain behind it. Now, there are reasons that have to do with the next game that I'm not going to get into right now where I need to really boost my stats. And so even though it feels selfish... I'm going to give these to me. I'm going to give these to me as opposed to spreading them out over the party. Like I think I gave one to Dupree last time. So who touches? I do. Strength and intelligence. Very good. But it took half my health. Who drinks? I drink. Refreshing. Okay. So now we can get out of here. Turn here. I touch. All right, drink. Oh, I'm already topped off. All right, cool. So now we're going to fight our way through those last two rooms and then go up to the north. So let's actually, before we do that, let's hold up in camp, get some health back for everybody else. Okay, we are ready to go. So we're going to have the same the same basic layout. No big surprises here. 
so once again I think we're just going to have a couple of us engage in combat and then uh, the rest are going to try to work on getting out of here again Oh, good job, Katrina. All right, good. So now we can get out of here. I will go down and get the gold. It wasn't much last time. It was only 21 pieces, so it wasn't like it was a ton of gold. But, you know, even a little bit adds up. Look, we're over almost to 3,600 pieces of gold, which is phenomenal. Um, I mean, we're still at over 6,000 uh, units of food, so we are doing really good. Um, I guess if we need to, I mean, I don't see us needing to, well, I'm, I'm speaking way ahead of my time. We have a lot of dungeons to get through, but at this point, I'm not seeing us needing to do a whole lot of restocking before we hit the abyss. There are probably some things we might want to restock, but... I'm also not envisioning, you know, spending hundreds of, of gold getting that done. So, oh, I could have had them go up. Oh, well. And that was much better. 86 pieces of gold. All right. Same, another verse, same as the first. Um, I'm thinking the melee people, I'm really probably just going to... I should have had him attack. I'm just going to have uh, them work on getting out of here. And we'll let the... Uh, we'll let the range folks deal with, at this point, the only thing left is the twister. Looks you are on the wrong line. I'm going to keep you there for a minute because you're the only one right now that can get anything on Mr. Twister. Pardon the pun. Uh, this guy seems to be liking coming straight for us, so maybe we will be able to get Joffrey or one of them to uh, do a little, a little bit on them. I don't think we saw last time what kind of hits that a uh, twister leaves, and I guess we still won't. <laughs> because it's dead. Okay, boy, I, these rooms are so interesting. Alrighty then. Um, all right, so we want to leave here. Yeah, we want to leave here from the north, right? Because that was the center room. All right, so we've got squiddies. Heavily wounded. Oh, you're not supposed to move, Squiddy. All right, I'm going to stay here. I'm just going to send our two melee peeps up. I'm going to leave you there. All right, that's right, we're down one. I want to keep this the people that are here in place. Because I'm not quite sure how this guy is going to juke and jive. He's heavily wounded. Yeah, 
and now it's gone. And out. So now then, let's go back to the map for a minute. And if you look at there, we've got to our, to the west here, we've got a square with four dots. I'm guessing that probably means like a hidden wall kind of thing, but uh, we're gonna check and see. So let's turn to the west and boom, 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 boom. Interesting, so we've got, all right, interesting. We gotta go out to the north, obviously. Uh, I don't think anybody's gonna advance yet. I don't want these people to touch us. I mean, I don't think two gremlins are gonna do much for us as far as stealing food, but why court it? I mean, we're gonna have to move up in order to, oh no, he's gonna, he's going to be very nice and come to us. Which, you know, is is mighty neighborly of him, I must say. All right, everybody else, I think we'll just keep you put. Victory, all right. Okay, so here we go. So we could climb, we could descend. We don't want to descend, we've been to level five. Let us climb. Okay, so we're on level three. Let's peer to Jim. Now this is problematic for us because, um, yeah, there's nothing else here. And if we go look at the notes and look at level four again, you can see we've got another staircase. If we've gone through that and gone to the south, there's another staircase going up. And so my fear is, if it's on level three, we need to go up that other staircase there that's down here in the lower southeastern quadrant. Um, but since we have a ladder that will take us further north or further up, we are going to climb again. Oh, don't tell me. Same thing. Climb again. And this is not even a way we can get out of the dungeon. Well, that kind of sucks. <laughs> All right, so we need to go back down to level four. All my hopes, let's see. So we need to turn to the east and go through. We're gonna have to fight the gremlins. Actually, let's not. I think what we will do is we are going to pause here. We are going to end this episode here. Uh, we're going to have to get back through this whole gauntlet. I can't remember if that was just an empty space. I actually think it was. I probably could have gone through, but we'll deal with that next time. And we're going to have to come down all the way through this mess again. And um, so we can get to the... Um, staircase up here and hopefully then we can find uh what we need as far as meaning the stone meaning the stone i'm kind of this is a big dead end i'm kind of disappointed in that but you know it is what it is that's why we're doing the dungeon crawl so i'm gonna let that be that i'll be back in your ear holes soon and until then be seeing you